Okay, so today we have been building up, building up, building up, and I hope that you are excited about starting writing now, okay? Because I was quite excited about this writing, um, quite enjoyed doing it. Um, obviously, it's quite difficult because you're there and I'm here, so we can't really share, right? So I have done as if I would do in class. So I would be looking for your um, your ideas and then um, putting them down on 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 the whiteboard and then sticking them all around the room, um, and then. The way we work is, um, I sort of if you if you struggle to uh, get started, maybe you can use the starting of mine, the beginning of mine. Maybe you can take some of the vocabulary that you like and and use it in your own. That's fine. We call that magpie. So uh, good ideas are good ideas. If you don't think any of my ideas are good, that's fine as well. As long as you do better, I'm joking. Um, but um, so what I've done is I have written my version. Can you find it? There it is. Uh, I have put this on the Padlet and in your packs too. So this was my plan. Very important that you actually follow your plan. I don't mean word for word. If you want to change things or um, or, or not include some things, but the the general root of your of your of of your story is going to follow this plan here. Okay, with little deviations, so sort of, you know, go off road a little bit, but um, that's what it's going to look like. So, um, this was mine. Okay. Um, so I will read it to you um, so you can get an idea because we, uh, maybe, you know, in class, I would probably get get yourselves to read, read this out to me, really. OK, so with his father's axe gripped tightly in his hands, Odd limped determinedly into the cold forest. Trees stood like soldiers guarding the path ahead as he waded through deep snowdrift that had built up over the long winter. So again, um, I've included things I know about Odd. Yeah. So fat, his axe gripped tightly in his hands because I'm thinking determined. Yeah, he's, he's determined. So he's going to be gripping that tightly. He limped. So we know he's got a limp. Determinedly. Yeah, again, he's determined. I put that. Um, Tree stood like soldiers guarding the path ahead as he waded through the deep snowdrifts that had built up over the long winter. So the long winter, I know it's been a long winter. Crows screeched and squawked overhead as the icy wind bit at Odd's face and hands. Uh, personification, icy, icy wind bit, I think. He struggled over falling trees, using his axe as a crutch to pull himself over, his face covered in the biting frost. So again, uh, he uses a crutch. So a little bit, and you know that that creates that picture in the in the reader's mind. Uh, he came across what was a great river. A waterfall stood with great icicles like dragon's teeth barring his way forward. Again, Odd came against the barrier, and again his quiet determination allowed him to overcome them. That and the unkind words of Fat Alfred ringing in his ears. So that's another motivation that drove him on. Fat Alfred been horrible to him. So when he probably thought about giving up, Fat Alfred, his unkind words said, right, I'm not going back there, I'm carrying on. I'm over that, I'm moving on. Finally, he reached his destination, short sentence. The cave was an open mouth in the white landscape. Remember that from my plan, inviting him inside. He made a fire, took a few flakes of salmon, he had brought and fell into a deep slumber and a thick fur blanket. Okay. So that was my my um, effort. A um, few things that I've read through now, and I've read it a few times to me and my wife. Um, but there's a few things that I would change again. I mean, I've used determinedly twice. I've used it there. 
and determination there. Maybe I can think of a different word for that. Um, there's a few bits I probably punctuate differently, but that's all right. That was my first draft. Okay. Um, so I hope that gives you an idea of the kind of thing that would be nice for you to include. Um, I have uh, included that in your pack. I think I've told you that already. So, okay. So I want you to, um, to describe Odd's journey into the forest until he reaches his destination. Have fun. Looking forward to reading these. Bye.